go out walking after midnight out in the moonlight just like we used to do I go walking after midnight searching for you I'm talking with Rosanna Vitro someone I have known for more than 30 years and have been playing on the radio all that time and enjoying listening to all that time. Record after record. How many now? 14? The, this new one, Tell Me the Truth, will be the 14th album. Indeed. And it's always, you always have an interesting hook going in, at least in the last 10 or 15 or more years, from tropical postcards to tributes to uh, Bill Evans and Claire Fisher and Ray Charles, great record. Randy Newman, great record, nominated for a Grammy, that album. So what's the hook in this record, Tell Me the Truth? Tell Me the Truth is a return to my southern roots um, where I'm uh, feeling that I'm looking forward at this point in my life and backwards at the same time. And the uh, political season that we're having in the world um, brought me to the down-home songs of the Southern composers, uh, songs that all speak of truth. All your quoting figures and dropping names Telling all the stories, always playing games Over there laughing when things ain't funny You're trying to sound like you don't need money You know if silence was golden you lead a life of crime You know your mind is on vacation And your mouth is working overtime On this recording, I actually go back to Southern composers who definitely have barbecue sauce on their music. Hence the title of your band, the Southern Roots Band That's with right. uh, Rosanna Vitra. First of all, my work partner for the last three albums is Mark Soskin. Uh, more known for his work with Sonny Rollins yes. than with anything Southern. But he definitely uh, is worldly in his musical arranging and taste, and we work together so well. I hired Rudy Royston, who's just killing on the blues, and Tim Reese, who has been playing with the Rolling Stones. Playing tenor sax. And I've got Mitch Stein on the guitar, who is just the nastiest <laughs> blues guitar player ever. Dean Johnson is on bass. He's been with you forever. He's, you know, he's his claim to fame was Jerry Mulligan. Nate Eklund is the uh, trumpet player who is um, really somebody that's, you know, te actually teaching at the Jazz House Kids these days, but has been part of um, Spyro Gyra and many great, great bands. So it's a killing band that I could do just about anything with. And you do, and you do. <laughs> talk about, let's talk about Tell Me the Truth. Here's the, uh, the album. This is the John Hendricks album, actually. And I loved it that he wrote to me this little poem. And he said, Michael, a short jazz poem. Listen! <laughs> That's it. And that was, that was his That's John, and you're doing the title to, track. In the middle of this project where I was really doing down-home songs about truth, I remembered this song. My husband, Paul, uh, I, he heard this, I, you know, I played this song for him, and he said, you've got to add this song to the record. And then it became the title track of the record because it, it covers everything that I have to say. It's just brilliant. And a tribute to John Hendricks, who passed away this last year, one of the greatest singers of all time. I'm tired of dying while I'm still alive. I feel I'm drowning in a sea of jive. I'm saturated with the abuse of youth. Oh, somebody, tell me the truth. Everyone's rapping about the hows and whys Oh, they just happen not to be too wise Truth's disappearing till it's out of sight Oh, 
somebody Tell me what's right Let's talk about On Your Way Down. That's an Alan Toussaint song. On Your Way Down, I originally had heard uh, Little Feet, the uh, rock group, perform this. And the message about uh, treat other people as you would want to be treated uh, hit home for me. And the music of New Orleans is threaded all through this, this album. It is down home. That's where it all came together anyway. But to you, the song is like the golden rule with a groove. It is, and and we put a sidewinder groove on it, you know, because I'm all about groove. Sunrise and sunset Since the beginning I know it hasn't changed yet People fly high Begin to lose can't see very clearly when you're in flight. It's high time that you found the same people you misuse on your way up. You might need up on your I've, I've actually called you a definitive jazz singer because nothing is ever quite the same. And that's unpredictability is what makes it sometimes even that much more exciting when you listen to it. Because listen to all that music that you've done. I mean, Ray Charles and, and Randy Newman and Bill Evans, there's a hell of a lot of music in there, in, in crossing and crossing in there. And it all comes together in you. I close this album with actually the first time I've recorded a gospel song on a record. And Cindy Scott and Kate McGarry uh, came to my house and sang this with me. When you talk about Southern roots, the word roots actually makes a point. Yes. Is that this music comes from deep in the earth, some of it. Yes, yes. This is uh, my true authenticity. Um, it's, it's just, it's the blues, gospel, jazz, pop. It's, the combination of all those flavors and tell me the truth and I'm very proud of it. Just a few more weary days and then I'll fly away to that land where joy will never end I'll fly away I'll fly away. 